guys, welcome back to my channel. And this week's plan with me is from May 7th until May 13th. I had an epiphany the other day that for last week, because it was May the 4th, I should have used one of my Star Wars kits, but I didn't think about it and now it's too late. So, oh well. However, I do have a spring kit from a shop that I have not used in ages. And I used to love this shop, but she went on a hiatus for a long time. So um, this is a poppy print shop and here's her little freebie. And then you have her little thank you card. And then you have your deco, your weekend banner, some little flags, some half boxes, all of your littles and headers, your headers, your littles, your um, date cover-ups, all of your full boxes. This one says find joy on every rainy day. And then you have your check boxes, your um, check flags, the washi, and then all of the little quarter boxes and extra stuff. Okay, so as of today, when I'm filming this, which is Monday the 7th, I have hit 900 subscribers. So thank you guys so much for your help in getting me there. And because this channel really didn't start to take off until I started putting my planner stuff on here, because we had a, the channel's been around for a while, but we didn't really post much until about a year and a half to almost two years ago. I started, maybe two years ago, I'd have to look. Um, I started planning, I started putting planner stuff on there and I had a small, you know, a little group of you guys that were helping me out quite a bit. And then I've got a lot since I started putting my book stuff on. A lot for me, that is. Um, but I wanted to do my first little giveaway. It's nothing big. It's just a small giveaway. But what I'm going to do is give this away. This is an envelope full of all of my extras. So if you've been watching this. This is like a ton of like extras. There's not a ton of stickers on all of them. Some of them have almost full pages. Some of the pages are almost empty, but it's still a nice little chunk of stuff. Um, there's a lot of headers and littles and um, half boxes and checklists and um, icons and that kind of stuff. There's not much as far as full boxes go, unfortunately, because I use almost all of them, but I will do another giveaway at another time with actual kits um, instead of just the leftovers. But I have a ton of them. I'm not using them. I don't foresee myself using them. So I figured why not just give them away. So I'm gonna spend this week uh, figuring out how to use raffle, co raffle copter and I will set up a raffle copter for this giveaway and you know, basic stuff. You just make sure that you um, have parents permission or you're over 18 and uh, that you're subscribed. And then I'll have the whole thing hopefully set up by then. I was gonna do it for this week's, the one that I, you know, gonna be putting up today, but I don't know how to use Alpha Copter and I have to figure that out. So I'm, I'll, I'll do it for this, you know, end of this week. So when you're seeing this, you can enter. So in the meantime, why don't we get this all started? So um, we have lots of said the headers, the littles. What am I looking for here? I need washi, full boxes, full check boxes, and then um, full boxes. Something like this, but you're gonna find a full page of in this uh, giveaway. And I'm actually gonna take this one and just stick it in here. Just to give you an idea. There, it's in an idea of what's in there. Um, I, I'm almost totally out of room. So I'm hoping that whoever gets it will really enjoy it. Um, I'm also hoping whoever gets it may actually just need the stuff because I know there's plenty of people out there who can afford to get weekly kits and may look at the stash and go, okay, well, that's not as much fun because, you know, we already have access to full kits and none of those are full kits. But I figured for somebody who is just starting out or doesn't have a lot of money to spend that the leftovers would be a lot of fun because it's something to play with. It's something to get started on. And that's how I started was just with little bits and pieces of stuff like that. 
So I thought that that might be kind of fun to, you know, for somebody. And I'm hoping that whoever gets it will really like it. And then I'll have a book giveaway. If I hit a thousand, I'll, get, I'll do a book one. And then we'll just, you know, do them periodically. I have no idea how I'm gonna do the book one yet. So if you guys have a, a suggestion, let me know. I have a bunch of books that are extras that I can send out, but it might be easier to just do like a, you guys tell me what book you want and I'll buy it for you and get it sent to you like through one of the websites that's worldwide, like um, book depositories was worldwide. And that one would probably be a great one to use for a giveaway because of that fact. And um, like Amazon, it is worldwide, but they charge shipping costs depending on where you're sending it to, whereas book depository doesn't. So I don't know, I'll figure it out. Uh, I also have books at home that I can use. I was thinking about making like an extra um, sleeve, like a book sleeve maybe and giving that away. But I don't know, we'll see. Let me know what you guys are thinking, what, what sounds like fun to you. Um, Cause any of those are, op are very valid options. I would totally be willing to do any of them. I just don't know which ones to do. So you guys let me know what you guys think. Which would you prefer um, for like the book one? Would you prefer if I did like giveaway from one of the books I have? Or do you take me to do a giveaway from like book depository? Keeping in mind that book depository you can take up to a month or more to get, depending on where you live in the world. But you get to pick out your own book. Something along those lines. Just let me know what you guys think because I am open to all possibilities and it's really funny, when I first started, I wanted 100 subscribers, but my ultimate dream goal was to have 1,000. And now that I'm at 900, I can almost see that mark. And I'm almost like, okay, I am right there. I am so close. So I feel like I can almost touch it. And I'm so excited about the thought that you guys are actually watching my videos and you're subscribing and commenting and it's awesome. I am, I'm just, Lord, I just, I cannot tell you how grateful I am that people actually care what I have to say. Sometimes I don't care what I have to say, but <laughs> you know, okay. All right, so, so far I have that left. I'm going to use at least one of those for the sidebar though. And then we have washi. There's quite a bit of washi in that pack too, by the way. It was just, I have a lot of washi and I very, very rarely use it all. I loved her kits. I hated that she was gone for so long and I'm glad she's back, but she's not very, back very sporadically. And I'd love to know, you know, be able to keep up with her again and actually be able to get her stickers more often because she was always one of my favorite sticker shops. All right, so we are starting on the 7th. We are one week into the month. My husband left on Saturday and everyone's worried about us and keeps asking how we're doing. And just so you guys know, the first day kind of sucks. We're fine for the moment. It doesn't really hit until after it's been a few days, like next weekend, we'll probably notice it more than any time other, any other time that he's actually gone because right now he just, just working so much such horrible hours right before he left that it's almost like he was gone anyways and so it's actually kind of a good little lead in to us not having him around at all which to be fair kind of blows but oh my 13 was on crooked so anyways um i went back to the doctor again uh, the doctor's like, oh, I can see that your skin just does not like this island because everything they keep doing for it, it might help some, but it doesn't help much. I may be moving off island before we need to simply to help get rid of all this stuff. But it's definitely not my finest funness, whatever. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm just... 
My point was I had a doctor's appointment today. They're trying to figure out when it's time to send me to dermatology. I don't know if you can see, but my hand's just really, really rough and dry. And that's what, I'm, that's what my whole body looks like. And it sucks because I have never had a problem with my skin before. So it's definitely something on the island. Joys. All right, I'm gonna put these little flags on because I almost forgot though. Um, let's put this one on because I think it's cute. Oops. Concentration. And then we'll put this one on top. So without him here, I'm not exactly sure what we are going to be doing this next couple weeks besides planning our trip. Our tax return money did come in, so we have our um, fund to get us around the world, which I am definitely excited about. Come here. All right, so the extras besides little things to do's in today's are um, to clean, reminder, errands, and next week. So none of those are particularly useful, but we will make do. And this kit does not look like it comes with a sidebar. So let me see. Okay, so most of my um, extra stickers ended up in the giveaway stuff. So I had to go find a habit tracker to put in which doesn't quite match, but it's okay. It'll be fine. And then we're gonna put one in for happy mail. And since there's not a designated little mailbox, we will put in here. Yeah. All right, so we have a little happy mail sticker. We can get everything situated. And then we have an extra box. And then we already got a couple of things from the middle today. I got my shakes and I got cat food, which is great because the cats are like out of food as of like today. So I was really excited to see that the cat food came. All right, and then for a habit tracker, well, let's see, the pink kind of matches. I think it doesn't have anything extra on it, so it should go pretty well with the rest of the spread. All right, so this is actually giving me kind of a chance to get into some of my, you know, fun stickers. So I was able to put this one down here. And this is for my quiet time because it's something I really want to try to stay up on and do better with is making sure that I get a regular quiet time in. All right, so I will fill the rest of that out once I know if I have any washi left. And then we're just gonna do today's like I always do. I'm gonna kind of mix up the headers a little bit instead of making them all matchy-matchy, which I do do sometimes. And just kind of start putting them all down with little chunks of washi. So, um, like I said, this week I had a doctor's appointment today and I'm so thankful the cat food came because the cats are starting to get hungry. Not like I'm not feeding them, but they just get accustomed to having lots of food in their bowl and there's not a lot in their bowl right now, but they don't complain. So they're, they're good cats. They're not like the type that will start get super whiny. They just get a little bit clingy. Like you gonna do it now? How about now? You gonna do it now? How about now? And part of me likes it. <laughs> I'm kind of evil. Part of me is like, oh, my sweet cat is all clingy. You want love? Okay, you can have love. When actually they're just saying, no, I, I, I want food. Jeffrey is that way all the time. He is a big foodie and he does not like to be pet really. And so he will, 
ignore you unless there's food involved. And when there's food involved, he's like, hi, I love you. You're my favorite human. You're gonna feed me now? So part of me kind of, you know, gets a little kick out of annoying him because then I actually get extra love. The two girls, on the other hand, um, one is, she's not a cuddly cat, but she's like a proximity cat. So she'll come lay near you. And that is her vote of endorsement saying, I love you, you're my person. I will come lay near you. Whereas my kitten is extremely lovey and really enjoys being right in your face at all times possible. And I kind of find it amusing because she's a little bit of a turd. And I kind of sort of love it because I have problems. Uh, she woke me up this morning by attacking my feet because to her, that was the best amount of fun in the entire world. It's attack mommy's feet, five o'clock in the morning. And then she kept me up for about an hour before I fell asleep. Okay, so we have basics down and our weekend banner is gonna go down right here. And then if we open it up. I think it's looking pretty good. I don't have to worry about drop off stickers anymore because I don't have to share the car. Huh. I still do have to pick up twice a week and I may put something down for that, but I don't have anything specific that I have to do because um, I don't have to share the car with anybody. And normally if I'm sharing the car, that's when I have to be a little bit more observant about what is going on around me. I was supposed to ask and see if my son can drive on base with just his permit, but I didn't, I forgot. Okay, so you have a little bit of um, decorative stuff. I want to put one of the little bird houses down. Let's put the little blue one down because I think it's cute. There, little blue bird house. All right, so I have a little bit of washi left. I have most of that page left, a little bit of this one, all of this one, most of that one and then this. So um, I'm planning on using this one, at least a decent amount. And then this one and this one. These three, I probably won't get a ton more use out of. We'll just put them aside for now. And if whatever I don't use, I will stick in the box of stuff to send out which I'm really excited about. I'm excited to have my first giveaway. Maybe that was a bad choice because the fact that it's glossy is kind of bothering me. Oh well, it's done now. I'm not gonna pull it up. All right, so for today, I of course have lots of YouTube to do because Monday is my YouTube day. And let's put down someone cute. And we're gonna put spell film really oddly. Okay, so I need to edit and upload my plan with me today. And then of course, um, you're seeing that I have you know, my normal YouTube stuff to do, which is the same every single week because that's just life with me, I guess. All right, and then I have an appointment today and I kind of want to border my appointment with a couple pieces of washi because I think it'd be cute. Um, let's do a bit of blue and we'll put the little blue piece on top and the bigger blue piece on bottom. Like this. So that way it's kind of 
encompassing. I this I found this on, on a sampler. I have a bunch of sampler stuff that I get in all of my orders, and I put them all in a couple of sleeves of my binder. Here, I'll show you. I have all my old glitter stuff, and then I have all of like my samplers. I just kind of shove in here, and I think I like it because it, you know, gives me a little place for all of my miscellaneous stuff. So I actually have binders all around me because it's just easier to keep track of stuff that way. And then after we got back from that, we went to Simply Foods to get stuff for dinner tonight. We are gonna make a vegan um, chicken and dumpling, which I'm excited about. So we did that. And then we're gonna have a little bit of a cleaning night because my kitchen's starting to smell funny. And I don't know if it's like the inside of my sink or if there's like just something in my kitchen that's just bugging me. I don't know which. So I'm gonna find out tonight. So we're gonna have a little bit of a cleaning night. And I'm gonna use a purple one. I want the thing on the other side. Um, but other than that, I don't know if we're going to have anything else planned, but I do have room if I need to add something to that. Let's put the little, this one down because it is a kitchen clean. Um, and then the rest of the time, I know that we have a few things coming up soon. We have like a, a day in, towards the end over here, like we're having a, a middle school thing right here. I'll, I have a dentist appointment here. Elise's concert is here. So we have a few things coming up, but it's nothing that's actually this week as far as I know, but I will find out. And if I need to add anything to this, I definitely will. So um, yeah, so I have one of those left and one of these left. And then I have all of the stuff that we already talked about. Just chilling here. These ones I'm not planning on using, so I'm gonna kind of put them aside. But, all right, so that is the start of this week. I hope you enjoyed, and I will be sure to update you guys soon. Bye. Hi guys, welcome back for an update on the plan with me for this week. Um, I have not been doing a ton. It's one of the defaults to my husband being gone, but on, Tuesday, I went through and I reorganized all my bookshelves. So I have all of my red book books on one shelf, my um, one set of shelves. I have all my to be read on another set of shelves and I have a ton all over the floor still. So I'm thinking of doing some re more reorganizing, moving some shelves around and buying two more. And if I buy two more, I may actually get them all on my bookshelves. So I spent the day working on my bookshelves there. And then, um, Yesterday, I finished finally updating my uh, memory keeper for last year, my 2017 memory keeper, which I was extremely happy about. I'm so glad that I was able to finally get all of this stuff done. And then I hung out with my friend Shannon in the morning. She came over to borrow some cashews and just hang out for a little bit, which was amazingly nice to be able just to spend some time with her. And then while I was working on my bookshelves, I was listening to my book. So I listened to my books here and here, and I was able to finish Blood of Olympus while I was working on, um, while I was working on my memory keeper. So I did literally a lot of listening here too, but it wasn't, I wasn't able to actually finish anything. And then today, I um, we're getting the, our water softener installed and I measured for new bookshelves and then I filmed my wrap up and then I also went out to the mall with my friend Angela. And then I need to go pick up my daughter. I was supposed to go pick her up a little while ago but I am being totally blocked in so she's hanging out at the teen center <laughs> as of right now. So those are the basics, and I wanna get some stickers to put in it so that it looks even prettier. But I am really liking how this 
this one is coming out as of right now. Um, I just feel like I haven't been doing as much because there's just not as much to do, I swear. Okay, so there's not a ton to put down for these ones, but this is one of the little teeny and friends and this is her working on, this is her working on, uh, playing with a big pile of books. And so I thought this one might be kind of cute to put in. And then we'll just put in some like little deco stickers with it just to kind of, you know, fill up the space a little bit. Hmm. That way it's not quite so bare. Just, it took all day to do this. I was working on this thing forever and I never quite got it finished. That's okay. And then my memory one, I wanted to use one of the sticker girls. I thought it was cute to be able to like, you know, I was working on my planner, which I still need to finish, but I'm making good headway on. And then to top it all off, we binge watched Fresh Off the Boat last night and finished all of them. So we are finishing series that we've been behind on forever, which is fun. I don't feel like I have much to say. I feel like I'm in a massive hurry because we have these um, guys here installing the water softener and they'll start drilling at any minute and it's loud and obnoxious. And so I've been trying to do everything super fast so that way they don't interrupt my filming stuff, which would be oh so much fun. I also got my SPC monthly in the mail yesterday. So that's, yeah, that's it. That's our so exciting time. Hopefully I'll have a workout done for today, which I left a little room for after I pick up my daughter. If she still wants to do it by the time I finally make it to get her, we were gonna go work out. Plus I have a couple of little errands to run, but nothing major. So that's it for now, and I will talk to you at the end of the weekend for the rest of the week. Bye. Hi guys, welcome back to my end of the week thing. So let's see, we've had a couple of interesting days here. So last time I left off, it was Thursday, I was gonna pick up Elise from school, and then we were gonna go work out. So we went and did leg day on that evening. The next day started some eventfulness. So the day started with just a normal run of the mill day and I ended up picking Elise up from school. Let me write that down. Hmm. Okay, so we went to the BX to get to check up on um, mine and Caleb's computer stuff, and they weren't ready yet. So we ended up just going to the commissary. We were actually gonna go to the gym, but the gym was closed, so anybody that was underage couldn't go. So it was just, we decided to like just forget it and not go that night. So what we did do is we did a painting night. We went to um, a friend of ours house, and we had like a girls get together and did some paintings. I can't show you mine because mine's still at her house because while we were there, Elise needed to make a trip to the ER. So she was laying on her stomach and she went to go roll over onto her back and popped her entire knee out of socket. And I can add a little picture in if you guys want me to, which I might do, we'll see. Um, but because she popped her whole knee out of socket, we got to go to the ER and she got to ride in an ambulance and my friends had to come drop my car off for me. And we spent literally the rest of the night in the ER until like the wee hours of the morning. So that was fun. And it didn't even stop Elise from going to ROTC the next morning. So we didn't get home until like two o'clock in the morning and I didn't get to sleep until like three and then she woke me up at nine to take her to ROTC. Basically all she did was watch and 
let everyone see her messed up knee. But that was fun. Okay, and then um, we also went to the commissary and did a bunch of other little things. So we had another cleaning night. I have been on a total cleaning freak out lately because apparently with my husband not being here and, hmm, let's do this one, this one's cute. A little muppet bucket. Um, with my husband not being here, all the things that were on his honeydew list that I've been waiting for him to do are now getting done by me because he's not here. He's not gonna be here for months. I'm tired of looking at all the crap. So I also went and got some bookshelves and organized all of our books because I was in desperate need of some new bookshelves. I um, now have all of my books on bookshelves and no longer all over the floor. So that means for you guys who watch the um, other videos, if you would like to see a bookshelf tour, I might be able to actually do it now. It won't be great, but you might actually get something from it. All right, and then to go with our organization and our cleaning night, we also did laundry. So let's just kind of write it in here. You're very loud. I can't help it. If you hear a lot of clunking and stuff in the background, that would be my daughter on her crutches, working her way around the house because that's fun to listen to constantly right now. All right, so today is Mother's Day and my boys are making me dinner and I am doing mine and my daughter's laundry because she can't do it. She needs her laundry done before school. So that's what I'm doing. I'm doing laundry and I'm cleaning more. I'm telling you, I'm like, if I didn't know any better, I would think I was nesting. Must be nesting for this trip because I want to be able to go do all this stuff. So we went to the store today to get stuff for tonight. And then um, so far I'm gonna be doing some, just some of my YouTube stuff because I enjoy it. And yeah, that's about it. Let me just get a couple of stickers for some of the stuff though. All right, so filming. And then we're gonna do a plan with me do three of them because get them all done because I want to. It's kind of hot in here though, so I may have to cut that short. All right, and I'm gonna put this here for the sewing that I did because that was a lot of fun and I wanted to have a little sticker for it, so I put one in. This one's not really a leg girl, she's more just a workout girl, but I thought she was cute, so I'll stick her in. And I think that's pretty much it for the night. Um, like I said, it is Mother's Day, so I mean, I don't know if there's going to be anything else going on. But as of right now, I think that is the basics. And I know we're going to have like a special dinner tonight. So I will just kind of put in, I'll put like a little banner in. And then I'll put in special dinner. That my boys are making for me because it is Mother's Day and they wanted to be nice and do something. So I sent them into the grocery store with my credit card, told them to buy whatever they wanted to make dinner and now they're making dinner for me. All right, so the pages that you've already seen that I've already put away, I haven't done anything with. I've got a couple of these, um, some deco left over, two boxes, and then some little bit of miscellaneous stuff. And I will be adding this, to more of this to the, um, the giveaway and I will start the giveaway as soon as this is up. It'll be good for a week. Um, it is going off of Guam time because I couldn't figure out how to reset it and still keep my time zone accurate on there. So I had to change the whole time zone, not just the time zone for this. So this is going to go off Guam time. You have one week. Um, if the raffle copter does not work, just please send me a comment and I will uh, figure out something else to do. But I do have that huge pack of stickers for you guys and I am looking forward to having a winner. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye.